Next question is from Cams. I've been looking into a second source of income and nutrition has been a heavy interest of mine the last couple of years. Are there any online programs you guys know of that are credible? Oh, we just mentioned it in the, Adam mentioned it briefly in the that last question we just answered. Um, NCI is one of our favorite online uh, certification courses run by Jason Phillips. The reason why we like them is because, of course, their information is accurate. Uh, but more than that, they actually teach you how to coach uh, clients online. They teach you the process of coaching, how to help them with nutrition. So one of the big, uh, I guess, one of the big problems, I would say, with online coaching, besides people who are not qualified, let's forget that, that's obvious, is that you have people who understand nutrition, they just don't know how to coach yeah. nutrition. They, they can't speak to the behaviors as much. And I, I think that you can have all the, all the book knowledge and all, you know, all, like everything from nutrition, like your background could be, you know, like a degree in nutrition, but it, it's going to be nil unless you're able to communicate all that and be able to convey that to your clients. Well, they're, they're huge on application. This is what, uh, again, this is one of the things that I really liked about Jason when we first met, like, you know, there's, there's certifications out there like Precision Nutrition, which is probably one of the most famous, right? They, they, they deal with a lot of pro, uh, pro teams and uh, probably the most profitable uh, nutrition uh, coaching out there. And that was his, his kind of direct competitor is him. And he, there's no knock on them whatsoever. The, the information, the science that's behind Precision is so, so good. The problem and the knock that, they, that he had on it and a lot of coaches do is – they get all this overwhelming information and all this great science and all the studies to support all this stuff, but then they don't know how to communicate that and then apply it to a client. That's Jason picked up where I think they left off. And he said, listen, this is where mm -hmm. he says, I see there's a huge disconnect from these people that go through this great certification, learn all this knowledge, but then don't know how to, to apply it to real life clients. And that's where he focuses a lot more of that is like, not only does he support and share the science, but then he also says, okay, now, now that you understand what the studies say and support a lot of like what we're talking about right now, now let's talk about, okay, you get this type of a client who comes in. How do you handle that? How do you now yep. start to, to, to deal with that? This issue? was a conversation I had with trainers all the time. It's like, I don't care how much, you know, I really don't care how much, you know, yeah. what I care about is how effective you are at helping your clients change behaviors long-term and the positive. That's really the only thing that matters. Your knowledge is what drives what you do. But if you can't influence your clients, if you can't train them or coach them effectively, all that knowledge doesn't mean anything. Now, that being said, I will say this. I do think, I don't think with the current situation that's happening right now that, there, that the market for fitness and health is going to go down. I think the market's still going to stay strong. I think where people go have fitness, where they look for coaches, where mm -hmm. they look for trainers is going to change. The market's going to look different but there still is a market demand for coaches and trainers. And so I think you're going to see a potential surge in online coaching, in particular online nutrition coaching. I just see I see that start growing. So do I do I think this is a, a good potential source second source of income? I do. You got to do a good mm -hmm. job, of course, but I I definitely do. And again, I think it's going to grow. I mean, what do you guys think about that? I agree. Yeah, I definitely think that, I mean, you've seen that with Zoom calls and the way people are meeting. It's all virtual now. So, I, I mean, that's a pretty pretty seamless uh, transition I would I would think for somebody to even even you know even personal like training coaching I think is going to be a lot more visible online you know going forward 